there! This is Amanda Wilkinson. I'm here to do a, another tarot card reading for you today. It is Monday, June the 28th, 2021. Welcome to my channel, whether you're watching me on Facebook, Instagram, or my YouTube channel. Please like, share, and subscribe. If you could go over to my YouTube channel and check it out, that would be great. I want to thank everybody who has been uh, supportive of me um, during this new journey of mine. Thank you so much. I really, really do appreciate it. How is everybody? I hope you're doing well. hope you're taking care of yourself, taking care of the people who care about you and the people that matter to you. And you are beautiful. You are gorgeous. You all have that beautiful star inside of you. If you would like a personal reading, please message me. And let's just get started. Let's cut the deck. Spirit. First card out. The Seven of Swords. Seven of Swords. Um... This, I do not like the Seven of Swords energy. Um, this person is sneaky. Um, he's sneaking away. He's got a knife here. Um, he's got feathers flying out of his back. Swords have these crow or raven, whatever this bird is, on them in this deck. This is Seven of Swords. This is um, air energy. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. This is a liar. This is a cheater. This is someone with masks. This is someone that is deceptive. This is somebody that is narcissistic. And according to the uh, psychological the manual, whatever it's called, that kind of narcissist. I only say narcissist when this card or the devil comes out. I don't use it all the time. Or any of the time, unless I see these, this, this, or the devil. But it's crossing this. It has to get better. The Nine of Wands. Oh, you've been through it. Oh, this is the Wounded Warrior. This person put you through hell. This is Fire Energy. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This is uh, been through the battle, expecting more of the same. Um possibly going to give this one last push what is consciously known oh the death card well here is some good news anyway you this is the death card and rebirth this is scorpio energy um as you can see inside the robe um there's trees and there's that beautiful star this is about rebirth this is um like a butterfly coming out of the cocoon this is the end of a painful cycle and the beginning of a new one yes i like that what is unconscious ten of pentacles oh you've got this is the happy family pentacles are money energy earth energy taurus virgo capricorn there's the happy couple, there's dogs, there's children playing. Um, this means um, absolute abundance in pentacles are money. Recent past, the ten of wands, okay, there it is. This person has been walking down this, this path. This is what happens after the nine of swords, or the nine of wands. Ten of Wands. This person is um, getting to the end of their journey, and they're going to lay down this heavy burden. This means this cycle is over. This cycle is over. This cycle is over. Near future. The Page of Swords. Oh. This person is spying on you. This is... Air energy, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. There's those birds again. This is stalker energy. 
um, maybe this person is watching you um, on social media or whatnot and Amanda says give them something to look at live your best life focus on your positive you are great don't forget that where do you find yourself the nine of cups oh the nine of cups this is a lovely energy this is joy fulfillment bliss this is the energy you want to be on to get rid of swordsy here this means you've raised your vibration and you're going to attract people that are at a high vibration too this is how we find we find a great person if you see here also cut well cups are water energy cancer by scorpio but there's an open chest with money in it high vibration energy beautiful external influences the eight of swords eight of swords you need to stop you need to cut these binds and take this blindfold off swords are air energy Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Um, the per this person is not. This person is not really bound up. Okay, you could see the person here. There's there's nothing on her eyes or anything. But when she's looking in the mirror, this is what she sees. Sh you need to look at yourself the way you really are, because you are fantastic hopes and or fears the four of pentacles you're holding things close to your chest pentacles are earth energy money taurus virgo capricorn you do not want to get hurt again oh general outcome the six of wands victory this is victory wands are fire energy Aries Leo Sagittarius. It's like she's like on a stage or something. This is a victory card. I like it. I like it. I, I think that you've left Swordsy. You've left Swordsy. You dropped this heavy burden. Started a new cycle. Seven of Cups. Oh, you have options. You have options. Um, if this is romantic, then you have people that are interested in you. And you have more than just swordsy here. There's You have your choice. The Queen of Cups. Oh, the Queen of Love. Person is loving, caring, compassionate. This is water energy. Cancer Pisces Scorpio. She has a cup. She is the cup. She is the queen of love. Or king. Page of Pentacles. Page of Pentacles. This is a message about money. Message about money is coming in. Pentacles are money. Earth energy. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. The sun. The sun is shining on you again. The sun. Look at this beautiful card. This is Leo energy. The sun is shining down on you, and you are seeing that you are worth you that you are incredible, and you deserve someone just as awesome as you are. And the fool, this is the new journey. This is the new journey. You're moving on. You are going to be victorious. Kind of like victory after the battle, I feel like. A personal issue reaches resolution. Full moon in Cancer. A personal issue reaches conclusion. Resolution. resolution. I'm sorry. Oh, I like it. Your commitment is being tested. First quarter moon. 
Oh, I was gonna. The answers you need are coming. Full moon in Gemini. All right, so. Victory is coming. Lots of opportunities. And the beautiful Queen of Love. And the sun and the fool a new journey. Victory. I love it for you. I love it for you. Uh, okay. This is Amanda Wilkinson. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Bye.